Welcome to this uh, Windows Computer and Technology channel and just um, to make sure because a lot of people are saying well you know I've heard that there are some app updates um, there's a new paint app stuff like that I don't see them uh, in Windows 11 you have to there will be more and more apps that are going to be updated through the Microsoft Store so in Windows 10, they already started that, and a lot of apps that were core apps with Windows are now distributed through the Microsoft Store and updated through there. In Windows 11, if you want to have the latest apps, make sure that you go to the Microsoft Store. Once in the store, on the bottom left, you'll see something called Library. If you go here and you click Get Updates, you will actually have all of the updates that are going to be updated um, with your system. So some of them have some small uh, changes, uh, movies and TV, your phone app, stuff like that. So check that out. Paint is one of them. You see it here. It's been um, updated in my machine. So for example, uh, when you have something, you just click the update button or get updates. And uh, then you have the core apps. Some of them have little things. And we're going to look at them um, in, in more detail here um, with uh, some of the changes there. One of them is Clock. The Clock app now has focus sessions. We'll talk about what that is all about. Um, if you haven't seen it already, you can actually check out. And if, if you have been updated, just click Paint. And you will have the new paint app which is a little different as you see it's changed from the original paint in uh, Windows 10 so these are all the apps that update through Microsoft um, store if you don't see them right away be patient it could take a few tries a few days but eventually they'll all be there um, in my case it took a couple of days before they were even showed up so uh, just be patient if you don't see them immediately they'll be there at some point check the store from time to time and at some point these core apps will be updated to the latest version uh, for sure so uh, you know this is the way that a lot of the feature or the core app features will be sent on uh, another example is notepad notepad is going to have an update also eventually. Right now, it's still the, old, the the notepad that you have in Windows 10, except it has rounded edges. But within the next um, few months, apparently, we'll have a uh, brand new notepad that will be uh, kind of redone. So we'll see what's all about. So Microsoft Store is the way to go for a lot of these features, and uh, that's where it happens if you want to have the latest apps there. More to come probably also in the future. And of course, the Microsoft Store is also where you'll get eventually the uh, Windows subsystem for Android that will run Android apps and so on. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.